room is a war room. Probably made it creepy for ambiance. Pretty blunt if you ask me. But I guess you can't expect much from kids. Wow. You're mean. <laughs> I'm glad you're on my side. That's a backhanded compliment. Maybe there's a hidden room behind that throne. Of course. There's always a hidden passage behind the throne. Everyone knows that. So it really was a hidden room. Do you think Byakuya could be in there? This is exactly the kind of room where he'd be hidden. Yeah. Uh, Togo, wait up! is inside a storage room. What kind of storage room would be up a ladder? Well, let's just check it out for now. are all photos of Junko and Ashima. Huh? This person is Junko and Ushima? She's different than how I pictured her. She looks like your typical trendy teenage girl. What are you saying? Do you know how many people have died because of her? Sorry, you're right. And more importantly, this creepy room looks like a cult headquarters. What happened? Take a look at this. The girl in this photo with Junko. I see. Really? That just makes it creepier. The way this photo was placed here, I guess this is Monica's room. I wonder she wants to be the successor. But don't you think it's a little strange? What do you mean? Don't tell me you're still on about that ghost or whatever. If you're curious, you can question her yourself. I thought Master would be here, since this is a hidden room and all. But I guess not. says we're almost at the highest level. No! You're surprisingly correct. That spiral staircase must be connected to the roof. No doubt about it. Master has to be on the other side of this door. Huh? You're not gonna lose your composure this time? You're not gonna, like, cling to the door and cry and shout and make ugly faces? Well, it's true that I might do that, but it's weird hearing it from someone else. When your purpose lies just before you, sometimes you need to be as calm as a corpse. It's a creepy example. Anyway. I'm not going to have some half-assed reunion now, but a full joyous reunion later. And when that happens, 
I'll cry and shout and make ugly faces at Master's arms. Are you sure he'd be okay with that? There's no way he'd dislike it. Jeez, you don't understand men at all. You need to be in love. A woman in love is the most beautiful woman of all. I'll try to remember that.
free of interruptions. All we gotta do now is get in the airship. Then let's hurry and end this. Phew. Terrible things happen to me in the city. And I have a lot of bad memories. But I am so happy that I was able to meet you. Why are you saying this all of a sudden? You can say that stuff after everything's over. <sighs> You're right. I'm sure that girl Monica is in that huge hall all the way in the back. Fear in here is practically screaming final boss fight. Toko? We've come this far already. Don't go freaking out now. They should be scared of us. You're right. Yeah, I guess you're right. After all, we're a powerful team. Wait, powerful team? Can't you think of a cooler name than that? Well, then you think of one. You're the ultimate writing prodigy, after all. Yeah, you're right. I'll think of something after the happy ending. Yeah, after the happy ending. Hey, hey, hey! So you finally decide to show up, huh? So slow! A black monochroma? What is he? Hey! I wouldn't expect some pasty for I... Yo, I'm so baller, if a pro I'd make a choke on the hater! What is this that... Could it... Does it have an AI like Shirokuma? Did you say Shirokuma? Brothers? Well, he's like a brother. But that ain't important. I'm talking about why Monica ain't here. To tell you the truth... Nap time? Oh yeah, she's still a kid after all. 
What is this? If you're brave enough chicks to disturb her nap, you can always try opening the door. Which door? Hell if I know. Monica made this little trap to keep out big mouths like me, see? If you open the wrong door, bl but if you leave a bee, she'll... S now what you what you gonna do? Kamaru, you've seen that Monica kid before, right? So what do you think? Any idea which door she would choose? Hmm. Rather than choose, it's more like... Which would she even be able to act? But it can't be that... Yeah, you're right. Are you sure? If you solve this quiz, you won't get to hear all the bitchin' lines I worked on. The title of Voice of a Generation hasn't been taken yet, so... I think I'll take it. Thank you! Damn it! I can't get these copyrighted songs out of my head! I'm bugging out! And that's the end of the third arc! If one of these doors is correct, we have a one in three chance of getting it right. Don't rely on probability! Hitting my head might make me forget. Be a clue. Come on, stop taking this so seriously and help me. Disabled. Uh, don't tell me. You saw my secret room, didn't you? So that was your room. I saw the photo of you and Junko, but something didn't add up. To even get to that room, you have. There's no way you would make a place like that your. I see. So that's how you figured it out. <laughs> you might have a stupid looking face, but you sure are pretty smart. Why pretend that you're disabled? Because pitiful children are the most powerful, don't you think? Huh? Monica's home life was terrible. She didn't feel like she belonged there. But Monica was more brilliant than her brother or her father. And they hated her for it. But then, I thought of a way I could counter their neglect and cruelty. All I had to do was become a pitiful figure. Then, I would have the whole world sympathy. The wheelchair was inconvenient, of course, but thanks to the act, I acquired much. I even acquired the Warriors of... And Papa and Big Brother were a little nicer. They thought they were the reason I ended up in a wheelchair, so they really pitied me. You tricked everyone, all this. You... You're the worst. You're more awful than all the other kids. Maybe. But to survive in that hole, when Monica talks, everyone freezes. When Monica... For Monica, the outsider, the eyesore, to survive in that house, she did what she had to do. I want to ask you, the Papa and Big Brother you mentioned, are they from the Toa family? Oh, so you know that much too. See, Toko? It wasn't a hallucination. The ghost was real. I it's a coincidence. Delusion and fantasy with a little coincidence mixed in. It's 
truth. Fantasy and reality overlap sometimes. I'm so desperate to make my fantasies real. That's why whenever I think about the girl... Okay, so now's not the time to get So you're the one who made Kamaru come here by using that skinny white-haired boy, right? Why would you do something that could compromise your own plan? My plan? Oh. Well, personally, I don't really care about that. Does it have something to do with the successor? Yep, that's right. The successor is the most important thing to Monica. And for that plan, after all, you are essential for this... Huh? Just what I'd expect from the little sister of the completely different than when I first met you. Savior? Kamaru has the face of a high school girl you'd find anywhere. But who cares about any of this? Hurry up and hand over the key to Master's room! Key? Monica doesn't have anything like that. Don't play dumb! Hand it over! Like I said, I don't have it. You wanna strip search me to make sure? Monica doesn't mind. But weren't you guys in a hurry? You wanna break this controller, right? You wanna stop Mr. Monokuma, right? Uh, is that... Monica Toa, Chief Executive of Toa Group Robotics Branch. This is the magic that Monica invented. And as long as Monica has her magic, Monica can control the Monokumas and the Monokuma kids. You're the one brainwashing them too? Huh? You didn't know that? Hmm. This idiot brat slipped up. In that case, I'll make you hand over the controller by force. And after that, I'm going to make you hand over the key to Master's room with even more force. Hmm. No, I don't think that's possible. After all, I have a trump card. A trump card? A super big, awesome battle robot the Toa Group Robotics Branch created. That is Monica's masterpiece. It's so much better than the other Warriors of Hope robots. So, Mr. Kurokuma, I leave it to you. Hell yeah! Leave it to me, Monica!
Yeah, you know the fucking drill. Yeah, you know the fucking drill. Nobel Prize for Monokumas, I got it in the bag! <laughs> 